now I have a different size and shape of a bottle with me and uh, what all I am able to see from my level is the top of the bottle is appearing this much in size over and the cap is like this and its sides are this much broader right this is this is just a small bottle now again very simple do a rectangle right make a center line in this rectangle if I want this oval to be there in this rectangular shape the rectangular shape must be of then this oval from the top and the curved line from the bottom both will come within this box this is the reason uh, the size of the rectangle is taken differently for in both the cases if the ovals are to be kept within this frame then the length of this rectangle must be this much and if the ovals are kept in between these top and bottom lines then the size of the length of this rectangular shape must be this much this is the way we generally do you must have noticed my style of working if we have to take complete ovals within these this frame then the com over the complete length of this rectangular shape must be this much right from the top and at the bottom the length must be measured properly so this is the way shapes uh, come out in different sizes lengthwise anyways in this case what we do we increase the size lengthwise to bring these both the ovals in this frame I'm making this rectangular shape again take the center line right now we have to calculate this in three different three or four different parts first the complete this oval For example this oval first this oval second its side shoulders and third the whole length remaining length say this much area I took for the oval then the shoulder length and then the remaining 
size of that bottle. Now, how much it's there in width, we have to measure, we have to mark because the cap of this bottle is narrower than this body. So, obviously, we have to mark this remaining for shoulder and the bottom now if we take the curves at every point what we get a great sized top then measure the side of this cap if it's this much in length then it must be equal from all these sides what you have to do simply join that's all Now the body shoulder line from the accurate side if the complete gap is this much that the length is this much for the shoulder part in both the sides then from the center also the length would remain same to make a to give a feel of the curve here right now what remains the bottom now if for example if this is almost looking like a circle here I uh, say this is the 80% of its own circle then it would come out accurate 100% because it's going down and it would come out accurate around but what I have done I have taken this oval I have taken this oval within this frame then what I would do I would make this circle within this line within this line then I'm taking the example uh, say the whole area of this circle is with this length this make a circle from this because if we if we need to make a circle then it it would come out from a square so it makes the proper square take the center from every side then make a point at every level start drawing this so here at the center it would disappear the rest of the part would disappear what we finally get in hand this half curve and it's a bit round than this curve this line if we need to increase the length of the whole bottle what we simply can do increase the length and bring this center of this circle down say this is the center of this circle if we are increasing the length this much from the sides then at the bottom also it will automatically increase then make a curve same the parallel to this from there as we made it here same case we'll make it here Bec it would remain same because we took 100% here the angle we are seeing it from it appears proper round from the bottom it can't be more than round 
because it can't be more than 100 percent doesn't matter how much the length you increase so the bottle will appear this much in length if we if you wish to increase the length again if we increase the length more say this much then also the amount of this length from each side from left hand side and right hand side if we have taken this much length then from the center we have to take the same length because this is the case of 100 percent because in a square all sides are equal then also it forms a circle so this is the reason if it's increasing from the half if it's increasing this much this much then again it would increase this much from the bottom right everywhere it is same so simply join it from here the half circle got it so this is the final shape coming out to be Basically, I'm doing the cleanup. This is the complete bottles look, right? This is only in a case when we have taken the top almost 80 percent obviously the size of the base increases then the top if this is 80 percent then the base would be 100 percent or you could have kept it to 90 percent or 95 percent but I kept it a hundred percent that means proper circle doesn't matter how much I kept increasing the length of the bottle it can't go beyond 100 percent so every time it makes a parallel curve so we can increase the length or decrease to this level if we have to decrease and again if you wish to keep it to 100 percent or accurate round then you cannot reduce the size than this but you can for sure you can increase the length of this uh, bottle as much as you want so this is the way things are handled managed sketched good planning high levels shapes measurements are very much needed thank you